prolific takedown artist in the UFC at present. And when you get some praise from Daniel Cormier, when it comes to your offensive takedown game, you know you're doing something right. And we talk about wrestlers and judo players and grapplers, but this guy just combines all of that. He is able to use foot sweeps from the grappling game. He is able to use throws from judo, and he's able to use wrestling in the, from the wrestling game to take people down. He has an array of takedowns at his disposal, and he uses every single one of them. From the speed of the level change to the timing to the knowledge of where to go next when the guy starts to defend, he's truly, truly something special. I don't think he could take you down, but tonight he doesn't have to. So he does not in have this to. matchup, prevailing wisdom is he'll be able to get this fight to the canvas. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So two years, the gap in age, and they both possess a similar height and reach. How about some Bruce Ladies Buffett? and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet eight inches tall, weighing in at 146 pounds. Fighting out of Modesto, California, Big. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, grip the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. They touch him up, and we are underway. a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Beautiful strike. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Blocks the shot. Oh! 
big head kick land. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Beautiful body kick. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Knee to the body. Just over three minutes to go. He is all about that left kick to the body. Gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Strong kick to the outside of that lead leg for him there. You do not want to hit too many of those. No, you can't. He does not wind up on that kick, but he somehow is managing to land it with so much force. Yeah. Able to check that kick as well. Unable to land with that punch. Oh, is he a good counter striker? Counters beautifully with the left hand. Got the single collar tie. Nice right hand. Big kick land. And both guys really throwing with authority. Kick now by Lee. Big off punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Just missed with the left there. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Well, I'm an identical twin. Two is better than one. You might as well double up on the jab. He did so effectively there. Doubling up on the jab, and you see his opponent's head popping back every time it lands. Beautiful kick. No good. Man, that hurts to watch as he lands another strike. Oh! oh! He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. They continue to exchange. <laughs> Unable to connect with the right. Final seconds of round one. Nice kick. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. All right, let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there, and he's not on his toes, and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their toll. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. 
All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Continues to eat power shots here. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Beautiful leg kick throw. Single collar tie now. Huge knee land. Watch the strike. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Back to the jab now, no good. Big and kick. Oh, that is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Just missed with the straight left hand. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. Little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here. And as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Some nice back and forth action here. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Wow. Oh, wow! Head kick. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Big kick land. Caught that kick there. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. Right hand on point. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Wow, what a kick. Straight right. Oh, that even hurts to watch. Huge kick to the body. Liver kick. Oh! Can't take many at all. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's got to be over very soon. Well, he has got to be thrilled with this effort here tonight. There was a lot of pressure on him coming in. He has doled out a lot of damage, landed a lot of strikes, and a near flawless execution. Sometimes the hardest thing to do is what's expected. When you're expected to win, sometimes it's hard to live up to that expectation. He lived up to that expectation, and he exceeded it with such a great performance. DC, didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Lee gets caught with that punch. Over and over, he's landing a big body kick. Changes his stance. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. 20 seconds left. Huge block there. Oh, and a nice jab by him there, and that's gonna give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. 10 minutes in the books. All right, so the round is over, but not before damage was done. Cut on the cheek, sustained in that round. Cut man in there quickly as usual to try to seal it up.
All right, so in entertaining five minutes, let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are gonna be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely, you're gonna see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets underway. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Oh, that right hand is on point. Man, doesn't take much for the redness to start. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. Johnny does it. He doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. Oh, thought he might have had that head kick, but just out of range. Leg kick. does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Able to thwart the single leg takedown attempt there. Effective strike there by Lee. a straight punch there, DC. We'll see if he can follow it up now. He has been throwing the strike over and over again. Look how crisp and straight he is. He blocks the shot. Three minutes to go in round three. Cable of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Well, we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. As of right now, he's thinking more defensively, and he's doing a great job of not taking any damage. Nice leg kick. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. See, you don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Big head kick lands. Out of range with that one. Well, that one should leave a mark. Outstanding leg kick employed there by Lee. All right, single collar tie now. Lee's head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. He's done! He's done! Yeah, it looks a little wobbly on his feet. Back to the feet! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Lee gets hit with a kick. Big combination. And a knee. now almost immediately on the right side of his body. Stuffs the takedown, no problems. Oh, 
he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Well, good job defensively there to block the strike by Lee. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game going tonight. He's a fantastic kickboxer, but tonight is the kicks that's leading the dance. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, that's the end of the round. He's got a cut on his cheek from that round. There are certainly worse locations for a cut on the cheek. It's not going to trickle down into the eye. Nonetheless, pretty significant gash. We'll see if the cut man can close it up. All right, let's check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. And what a display on the feet. Huge knockdown with that kick. Yeah, he's a high-level striker. He throws these kicks to the body. He throws them low, but when he goes up top, he's very powerful, and he can end anybody's night. The toughness displayed by his opponent allowed him to stay in the fight, but he cannot Let's take any more of those types of strikes. Nice punch, man. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Plus right hand is true. Oh, nice. Nice. That's a big strike right there. Big head kick land. Oh, Superman punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Lee's kick to the body, that one blocked by the defense. Get him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Big kick land. Oh! Oh! oh the this fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent started going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Ooh, blocks the shot. Checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He got him hurt very bad. Now we have to find one more strike to end the night. Well, he's up, but oh, is he hurt? Three minutes to go. Taking land. Nice loop and punch. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Real sneaky body kick. Powerful leg kick lands. Leg kick after leg kick after leg kick. Oh, and he lands another punch there, and you can tell at this point he is going right at that cut on his opponent. Right at the cut on the eye, just making sure he knows that I'm going to be targeting it. Keep your hands up, and when the hands go up, he will then change the target down low, trying to find finish. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Under two minutes now to go. In the round. Nice. Back and forth we go. Caught that. Now there's danger in that too because when you start reaching out to catch that kick, here comes the high kick and then you're in a lot of trouble. There's no tell on that leg kick. Real nice body kick. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Oh, big punch land. 
Lee's punch to the body is blocked, so no damage done there. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. Slips that left hand. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. His opponent's got him in the clinch. He needs to break away and get back to his range because he's taking punch after punch from his clinch position. 30 seconds to go now. What a body kick. Oh, and he tags him with the straight, beautifully placed there by Lee. Nice job moving off the center line. He slips to avoid that right hand. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. All right, so a big knockdown for him, courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's a replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well, but when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal, and if he can land, he does have the ability to damage it. Striking is unbelievable. You're mixing it up perfectly. I love what you're doing with your kicks. Keep those going. He's slowing down. Fifth and final round. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. He's just being more aggressive, and because he's being more aggressive and more loose with his strikes, he's landing. Oh, huge Superman punch. Beautiful hit, hit. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the... Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Nice straight punch. Oh, oh, man, that's as good a punch as he's thrown at. Trying to counter, you gotta be first when you're the guy that dictates the center of the optimum. Beautiful body kick. Oh, nice. Looked like he might have landed there instead. A swing and a miss by Lee. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Effective punch there by Lee. And they set. It's very tricky to really throw that body kick. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Now look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. Crazy accuracy and efficiency with these ground and pound strikes here. And if you're the opponent, you got to intelligently defend or the referee's going to stop the got to defend. But you can see him now starting to gain posture and the intensity at which he's throwing these ground strikes is starting to improve and starting to elevate because he knows that he can get the finish. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. A real quick leg kick. 
reverse leg kick. Opponent limped it a little bit, tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the complexion of this fight. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. 90 seconds and counting to go in the fight. Just missed with the leg kick. Oh, hook shot blocked there by Lee. All right, well, time is the enemy now, DC, and he's really running out of it if he's gonna get his hand raised tonight. He's gotta go forward. He's gotta just throw everything at his opponent to try and find that punch or that kick. Whoa! And just like that, the fight is over. He got him! Just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there. And I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, so he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. And there he is after a massive knockout here tonight, near perfect execution and a seminal moment for him here in the Octagon tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliante has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 57 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee! So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result tonight as he gets the win by knockout. He spoke it into existence. He said over and over to anyone that'll listen, I am going to knock this man out. He did it in an even more impressive fashion than he ever could have imagined.